Uh, hello everyone. Uh, welcome back to uh, Sir Chancelot. Uh, I know it has uh, been a, a very long time, um, but just for the next couple minutes, I kind of just wanted to uh, talk uh, about a couple things that I've been thinking about um, lately, and really just to say uh, thank you. Basically, what started all of this was I, I rewatched a lot of um, old videos on this channel, which I really haven't done in a very long time. Uh, I guess as a starting point, I um, am at film school. I just am finishing my uh, second year here. Um, and by finishing, I mean I'm moving out uh, later tonight. Um, so yeah, it's um, really just kind of gone by quickly and the channel has just um, kind of completely taken the backseat. I haven't really thought about it. And in my head, I kind of just wrote those things off as like silly videos that, um, you know, I made when I was a stupid kid and they're just kind of stupid and they're not, uh, they don't really relate to me and what I'm doing now um, at all. You know, they're relics of their time uh, and whatever. Um, but I rewatched some of them and uh, really they're not that bad. And in fact, I, I, re I was really entertained <laughs> by a lot of them, and I, I don't know, I, I, I felt really guilty um, about writing a lot of those off. And I guess that just kind of got me thinking about the channel in general, and it's like, I had this realization of, oh, the channel is almost a decade old. And I guess it just kind of put it into a perspective of like, oh, I was like a child <laughs> when I started doing this. And like, of course, it's not gonna have any bearing on what I'm doing now. And like, yeah, I don't think of those as like short films that I like, use to pave my way to now be at film school. It's like, you know, I'm a screenwriter um, here and um, I don't, I have no idea if I'm good or not, uh, but uh, two of my films got made uh, this year as like the second year thesis films. Two of the films that I wrote got made and um, they just had their premiere like in the big theater um, yesterday and it was just this really surreal thing and it's like, yeah, I don't see any continuity from Sir Chancelot uh, to that. But at the same time, it's like, you know, I don't know, it's it's all kind of part of the same uh, journey. And uh, I don't know, I just, I, I can't help but feel a bit nostalgic for a lot of those um, skit adjacent things, which I mean, I, I don't know, I think just comparing them to short films or like scenes uh, is what, or as I was doing, was really not um, a fair comparison because they are skits and skits are different from scenes. A scene has real characters that have change. You know, there's all these qualifications, whereas uh, if there's no change, what we're taught at film school anyway, uh, if there's no change, then it's a skit. And if there is a change, then it's a scene or a film, it's a story. I don't entirely <laughs> agree with that necessarily, but I do definitely think that uh, not all skits are on the same, you know, there's different qualifications. And um, yeah, looking at them as skits, it's like, yeah, those are cool little things that uh, I did with some of my friends uh, when I was younger. And it's like, yeah, and as I kind of got more and more into movies outside of that, I kind of tried to take the channel in that direction and it, it never really went anywhere. But at the same time, it's like that really did help me get through um, to a point where I'm at now. Uh, and, you know, I was just thinking like, I used to like think I could be a YouTuber, which is so, I know silly now, but uh, you, you have to remember like, again, this channel is almost 10 years old and there was a time where this channel was monetized, you know, and I made $12 from uh, ad revenue that I never got paid because my channel got demonetized and they, um, YouTube only sends you a, a check if it's at a minimum of $100. So I, I made 12 and I never got it back. Um, but you know, it was like I was in middle school and my channel was monetized. I got a thousand subscribers and it was like, okay, well, I'm barely doing anything. I'm a little ass kid. If I continue to build this and I continue to like grow at the rate that I was growing. Yeah. I mean, I would have gotten 10,000 subscribers by high school and maybe, yeah, I'll make a little money from the channel. Like it, from a middle schooler's perspective, it's like, that's not too crazy to think about. I, I guess I, I've really almost forgotten up until a few days ago that like there was a, a real chunk of time where every single day I would think about the channel, about Sir Chancelot. And like, that's what I wanted to do. It was like, how am I gonna grow this? What uh, cool things are we gonna do? And I never really followed through with much of it. Um, 
because I was a little kid and I didn't really have concrete interests. And it's like, well, now I have the concrete interests and they're not really that compatible with YouTube. Um, and so, it, you know, it just kind of grew apart, which, uh, you know, I think anyone that, I mean, if you look back a decade ago, it's like, obviously, most people that you were around uh, aren't going to be around the same capacity. Most of your interests are going to uh, drastically have changed. Hopefully your personality has drastically changed. And I don't know, I guess it's just like, um, it, I, I don't know, I just feel like it's really cool, kind of, um, that like, I have this document of this thing that like, is this continual project and uh, I just haven't been looking at it in the right way at all. And I guess I also had the thought of, I had at one point 1,300 uh, something subscribers and my subscriber count has been going down for almost the majority of the channel's existence now, uh, since like 2018, so uh, six years ago now. So my channel has, has been uh, decreasing in subscribers actually uh, for the past six years. Um, which is so crazy that like the the peak of my channel, the peak of my like uh, YouTube creativity or whatever was when I was in the eighth grade. <laughs> it's, it's really, really funny now. Um, you know, in high school that was frustrating because it's like, well, why, you know, surely I wasn't funnier then than I am now or whatever. But now it's just, that's just that is really funny in general. Um, but it's still, it's so I'm at like a thousand two hundred something or whatever. But then I was thinking about like, that's more, like, that's a larger number than people that are at my school right now. And that was like, you know, I, I don't get that many views, there's not that many active subscribers, but it's like, that that's weird. <laughs> I guess, I like, I, because I, I literally, like, I, for the last month, five months or so, say, I have not even thought about the channel a single time. And it's like, taking a step back and like re-examining this whole thing is like, wow, that's, that's, that's weird. <laughs> that's weird that in middle school I had that audience, you know, and for nothing, <laughs> I mean, you know, I mean, it's for some stupid skits, but it's like, yeah, I mean, compared to what I'm doing now, it's like, yeah, it's, um, it's just really, really different. So I guess just to clarify, because I know I've been rambling, this is not an, a, like an announcement that I'm coming back because this channel is actually cool and I just remembered we're actually going to go to daily uploads. Like that's a meme for a reason. Um, but I guess what this is, is just like, I don't know, just thinking about the people that are still here and like the audience and the just experiences in the community that this has allowed me. And I, it really has been, uh, I mean, I know sincerity is like stupid or whatever, but I mean, it has been a privilege to uh, like meet so many people. It's weird because I almost like, at this point, I don't really have an audience. It's just like my friends, but a lot of these like friends, at least online, um, like I met through like this YouTube community. <laughs> so it's just like, yeah, it, it's cool to like, I don't know, have uh, friends and have like a, a continued um, support through all this and through all of the changes and just, yeah, I guess I just, uh, kind of wanted to, uh, thank everyone who's still around and everyone who, uh, was ever around because it's, um, this really weird, um, thing and yeah, I don't know. I'm not going to say that like this is the final video or whatever because I think a big part of like why I kind of stopped making videos or why I became sort of more and more distant was a, a, a real kind of frustration as well as just a natural, you know, I'm doing other things. Um, I think uh, there was a large part of it that was like, um, I should be like making cool stuff because I have an audience and also, or I, I have the subscriber count. And also I'm like getting into filmmaking and I guess looking at those skits as like, oh, these are bad films. Like the, I need to be making things I can put like in a portfolio, and you know I have like a DSLR or whatever. Like these, these are sh these should be things that look good. I mean, obviously, as you can tell from this, <laughs> from the footage right now. I mean, I never really learned any camera stuff. I'm still at film school. I, I made a I made a movie or two, um, but yeah. So it's just I think I started putting a lot of pressure on like having things be good or like watchable or quality, and I don't know. There's I'm also doing like portfolio reviews right now for my, uh, to like apply to get into the screenwriting uh, program or like sort of major, I guess you would say. Um, and it's like, I, I guess I'm just thinking about a lot of things um, already because of that. And then applying it to the channel, it's like, 
I, there's this quote that I don't know where it's from, and it's kind of cringy and it'll sound pretentious at first, but I do think it really applies to a lot of uh, kind of my own create, creativity and like creative process and like uh, hindrances to that, which is um, my, my taste exceeds my ability. And again, that sounds really pretentious, like, oh, I have such good taste. But I mean, it is really kind of, I think, a very relatable thing if you stop to think about it. It's like, the things you enjoy, you are not going to be able to make. And that is a real divide, and that is really frustrating, especially for me, who watches lots and lots of movies, at least from a film perspective. And then I also, at least used to, I would watch a lot of YouTube. And it, just seeing that disconnect, it, it was very frustrating. And I think... Um, that's something that is a real issue for me for my screenwriting, and I think that's also the reason that uh, the channel uh, frequency fre frequency uh, really dipped because I was trying to make things quality. I was trying to match this expectation rather than just doing things I was enjoying. Because really, I mean, I wasn't enjoying doing a lot of uh, the like later videos type things. So yeah, I don't know. Um, which is like you know, it's, again, now I've like had this like year or two, I guess two year break, really, from like doing anything with this channel. It's like looking back on it, it's like, why Why did I feel like I needed to post stuff if I wasn't enjoying it? Like why, of course, you only make videos for the sake of enjoying it. It's like, that just seems so obvious now, but looking back, it was like, yeah, I haven't like enjoyed doing that in so long because it's like, looking farther back, it's like those skits and stuff that are good and fun, it's like, we were just like hanging out. It was just like some friends hanging out. That's why I think the, the channel really did maybe not peak, but one of the last good videos. And the reason it's still like the pinned video on the channel is the uh, Halloween special, the Halloween extravaganza 2021. So I guess that's even like three years ago now. <laughs> um, so it, yeah, and that's just like, you know, just friends hanging out, going on, going on an adventure. And yeah, it's like, on the one hand, that's cool, and I could say, like, so I'm gonna get back to doing stuff like that. But it's like, you know, I mean, we're in college now, you know, like, things things are different, you know, we're, I'm, you know, we're all in our 20s, <laughs> and it's not the same as uh, just being uh, in middle school or in high school. And it's like, yeah, we're still young and everything, but, uh, you know, it, it's different now. So, I mean, sure, we can, I, I don't want to say, like, this is the final video, I'm done making videos, uh, but I'm not gonna, like, pretend that like I want to go back or something it's like yeah it's cool but it's over you know and I want to keep this channel around maybe I'll unlist some things maybe I'll make some things public um and that's just you know for the sake of um you know my own image I mean it's myself and at the end of the day it's like yeah I probably don't want a video a really cringy video of me from almost 10 years ago now of me rapping about uh, pepperoni pizza and salt. And it's like, yeah, that's funny. Yeah, it has like 15,000 views or whatever, but I probably don't want that up there for <laughs> that much longer, even though it is cool. I'm not gonna delete it. I'll keep it unlisted and maybe I'll make like a playlist uh, that'll be shareable to everyone. But yeah, I don't know. I, I just, um, I, I wanna keep this channel around and I wanna, um, have the option because I mean I again it's like a thousand two hundred subscribers is a weirdly high amount of uh, people so I want to keep uh, doing stuff um, if I feel like it if I feel like it could be fun to do something because um, yeah I mean I think also just like not putting pressure on myself like this has to be funny this has to be entertaining and just like kind of talking Joel Haver style you know because uh, I, I have some things like I want to talk about like I've, I've wanted to make a video about um, film school uh, like applying to film school uh, ever since I got in because there's a lot of really really bad videos about it that I know I had to watch uh, like when I was trying to research like how do I get in like in high school because um, I had no idea what I was doing and there's a lot of really bad advice out there and I kind of want to um, make something like I want to make the video that I wish I had seen and like just, you know, stuff like that that doesn't have to be so serious, or I mean so, uh, like shitpost all the time. That could just be, you know, uh, a casual thing that I just kind of want to put out there and just not thinking about growing an audience. Because it's like, yeah, I, I think it's pretty safe to say the channel is dead. Like I'm not going to be a YouTuber and I don't want to be. You know, I, I don't want to like have to make videos or I don't want that like any kind. I don't really want an audience, you know, because I, 
I have like my own screenwriting stuff. Like I, I'm doing my own stuff and it's like, I don't, I don't need this other thing. Uh, but yeah, I have to go pretty soon because there's uh, more films made by upperclassmen that I uh, worked on the crew for as script supervisor. Maybe I can make a video about that, you know? Um, if I bet you guys don't know what that is. Um, so maybe, you know, stuff like that. So I, anyway, I have to go soon. Um, I just wanted to say thank you guys for sticking around, uh, the few of you that are left. Uh, thank you for, I mean, anyone that has ever contributed anything to this channel because, uh, yeah, there's some uh, cool stuff and cool memories and I'm really, I just, I guess what I'm trying to say and I didn't really understand, again, these are, these are just my thoughts in the moment, but I think what I'm trying to get at is that uh, thank you for this cool experience, you know? It, I, I guess just like this uh, whole thing is like a, a weird thing that most people don't get to experience and uh yeah i just uh thank you for taking part in it and uh i uh yeah i uh